Have you ever had kidney beans or rajma in Hindi? I find them very tasty. But do you know how did they get their name kidney beans? Well, because apparently their shape is like our real kidneys. When the shape of our kidneys is discussed, something like this comes into your head. Well, today let's learn about the structure of our kidney more in detail. It has an outer region called the cortex and an inner region called the medulla. The cortex is darker comparatively to the medulla. Now, this medulla drains the urine into a funnel shaped structure called the pelvis. Pelvis continues to become a ureter. Now, did you know that the kidney has microscopic small small tubules which are millions in number? These are the nephrons and they are also called renal tubes. These nephrons are the structural and functional units of a kidney. Meaning all the function of the kidney is performed by these nephrons. The nephrons have a Bowman's capsule which is a cup like structure. The nephron originates from here. Bowman capsule goes on to become a tubule which is narrow in width and also twisted towards the end. All of these open into collecting ducts and all these collecting ducts unite and open into a ureter. But wait, what is this ureter? Ureter is the uterine tubule which carries the urine from the kidney to the urinary bladder. Urinary bladder gets full and that's when you feel like peeing. Now that we've learned about the structure of the nephron, let us learn an interesting fact about them. Did you know that your body has around 1 to 2 million nephrons in it? And they also start to fall at a rate of 1% a year from the age of 40. But well, calm down. There's nothing to worry about because with age, these nephrons tend to enlarge in size. So, what have we learned today? We have learned about the structure of kidney and the function of these nephrons. So, until next time, happy learning!